Hey guys, welcome back to Seed Story Cup 4. I'm joined, I'm Firebat, and I'm joined here by Stan Sifka. How you doing? Good. And Zalay. What's up? Yeah, and yeah. we're here to cast a rematch between Rectful and Elki. Zalay, what is your opinions on the match? It's going to be exciting. Anything could happen. Yeah. My money's on Elki. He won the last time, right? Yeah, he's got to be favored. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah. usually after you beat somebody, you're probably pretty good at beating him again. Yeah, with he the has same exact 100% win rate against yeah. him. So <laughs> it's pretty good. So. Wow. Yeah. So would you say the odds are 100%? Mm, very close to it. Very, like, very nine, close. 95 or something. 95? Like. I'm gonna say closer to a 50-50. You're <laughs> closer to a. I think it's like, I would have to go like 70-25. Elki played really good. 70-25. Uh, Rexful was really 70-25. It's interesting cuts. Yeah, I mean, five percent of the time there's a draw. <laughs> yeah. Disconnect. Things happen. Okay. I mean, it's Hearthstone. Okay. Yeah. You know, RNG. Sure. <laughs> sure. <laughs> yeah, but uh, but uh, actually, Elki surprised me here a lot. Yeah. Yeah, he surprised me a lot too. Like we saw him at BlizzCon, he was kind of shaky. And then uh, we see him here today. He played very well. Like, yeah. Exceptionally well. He had, like, not very many plays that I personally disagreed with. Yeah, he played, like, professional, so... Yeah, definitely very impressive for him to pick up the game and then perform so well so quickly. And meanwhile, we have... Rectful, he had kind of a stumble. Like, in uh, his first series with the uh, the shield slam, not exactly dealing six, only yeah, five yeah. to the six health minion. Rolled low so. on shield slam. Yeah, yeah. But then... Uh, <laughs> Roll, roll, roll. <laughs> never, good, lucky. Yeah, never lucky. Never lucky. Yeah. Hearthstone. But then uh, he came out his game against Lothar. He played pretty well. Yeah, it's so true. he definitely recovered from that. So he has a chance. Yeah. He, he has a chance. <laughs> that sounds so bad when you say it like that. It sounds like you're trash talking him. Some people oh were saying God. that uh, Elki's play earlier with uh, the three-three void caller and uh, what was it Draxus in hand or Malganus? Malganus. Malganus yeah. Yeah. And yeah, going yeah. face. He went face instead of trading to a seven-three frothing. Some people are just saying that was the play of the tournament so far. Like yeah, a lot that of was, yeah, it was very smart. Very player. good. Yeah, yeah a lot of people would have trade there, and uh, no, I probably would have. You you don't win the game if you trade there. You just like you're playing not to die. Yeah, but yeah. But it's such an obvious play, man. No, you, <laughs> it's the, an obvious the, wrong play. But it's <laughs> it, going face is correct there. It's actually yeah. like a super good read. And it's like a poker play, right? Like yeah, like, yeah, yeah. It disguises your hand really well. Yeah, give it, yourself an out. Yeah, give yourself an out. It's smart. So, play. first game. the game. So we got the zoo coming back. Argent Squire in the hand against Control Warrior. Who do you think is favored, guys? In general, zoo. But yeah, Fiery War X changes things. Yeah, Fiery War X yeah. brawl too. Bro is decent. Yeah. Do you keep it off the mulligan against you? I don't usually like to keep it, but I could understand doing it. Like yeah. I usually try and find the early pressure. I think it's more, like it's more likely the early game removal is going to be more helpful than brawl because sometimes they have too many death rattles and brawl could be like potentially useless <laughs> if you don't keep up with them. Yeah, exactly. And yeah. Egg hunt and creeper they can but, make it really bad sometimes. But sometimes it works out. But and then you get the works so anyway. Anyway, so the brawls gonna yeah, be fine. That, the brawl's gonna be terrific. That's exactly yeah. what you want to do. You want the weapon and yeah, then the brawl. And the brawl. Yeah. yeah, perfect. Well played. So advantage right. Rekful. Yeah. <laughs> so do you think if Rekful like looks really hard at Elki, he can see the reflection of the screen in his sunglasses? Uh, sort of like ghosty sort of thing. So like, look at his, Elki's picture there. You can kind of see the screen. Yeah, yeah you can see it. But if he's we, a pro gamer, so he doesn't see very well. So I should <laughs> mention <laughs> Elki has like he a focuses good on hand. Yeah, too yeah. much as I can't see. <laughs> Elki right. has a good hand against these weapons, right? Like, the weapons don't oh, yeah. mine yeah, up yeah. that efficiently. A good hand in general, yeah. That's, That's what you want with Zoom. But the Echo is also very strong here, yeah. so... Yeah, so Echoid on one, one. Set up the Dust by the 2-4 next turn. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, what you do here? Creeper. Just Abusive and Creeper? Yeah, oh, yeah. deny the extra draw from Echoid. Yeah, yeah, definitely just take care of that. Get a 1-1 one, one generated. They don't have a Dust Bite up now, so they don't have a Whirlwind ready. So, extra 1-1s. One, Seems pretty sweet. Or maybe you can play Egg, because if the Creeper comes up before the Bite, the Bite's going to destroy the tokens, so yeah, okay. it makes a lot of sense to play it after. But sure. I like that play. It's, he just really wants to be chipping away at the armor, I guess, earlier. Two Death Bites and a War X. He's got the whole armory with him. Yeah. Don't actually want all four weapons. Two yeah. It's a really good number. Three's yeah. okay. Four, you're getting like a two is upset. probably the best number. Yeah, and, like yeah. the four yeah. is most of the time too much. Yeah, but you yeah. can't really complain though. Like yeah. against Zoo, if you get weapons, you're happy. It doesn't yeah. even matter one, two, three, or four. Like, you rather have four than zero. So. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so you're just gonna clear the boss and the next turn probably the creeper. Yeah, take care of the boss, then kill the minions. Yeah, I like it. Uh, taking his time with his turns, figuring it out. He goes with that line. So as Elki, I would draw like a Doom Guard. Yeah. Something to make the void. He's hoping for Demon, definitely. 
The, no, the boom, boom, boom. It's not going to be bad as well. Oh, yeah, it's a big minion to play Snapchat. for sure. He didn't want to go for the void caller believe play. But yeah, I'm actually surprised he's poker player, so he could yeah. snip. But he figures if he taps, worst case, he's playing egg afterwards. Yeah, but yeah that is kind of a bad case. That's uh, this not play a lot of is uh, good against brawl, though. Yeah, it's Which very good so. against brawl, but you're yeah. not pressuring not really, at all. Like, just he... like on board, you have zero pressure. Yeah, yeah, that's true. You do need to kill control warrior eventually, otherwise they will have those big minions later on in the game to really just. Uh, Snowball you out of the game. Yep. And, but uh, he has big minions on his own, like he has boom and sure. Kind of stuff, so. But is boom really comparable to things like Alexstrasza, Grom, Ysera? The difference is Warrior Baron has Yedin, removal boom. for the big minions and Zoom yeah. doesn't. Yeah, yeah that's true, too. that's true. a big factor for the tempo swings. So there's the Void Caller. Yeah, coming down to try and pull out the other Void Caller. Mm -hmm. So if you Despite it, worst case, you can Unstable Ghoul and eat a hit from whatever, but this is pretty strong. Is it like you're gonna kill an egg? an egg for him, yeah. Wow, well, where went, so... Yeah, I, will I would play. probably spend a little bit more time on this turn, but... Wreckful uh, plays from the heart. He yeah. does. He told us actually earlier at one point, he said he does not really like to think before he plays his cards. He just goes completely instinct. Oh, it's interesting strategy. I mean, <laughs> interesting strategy indeed. Well, he's had a lot of success like as a pro gamer in general, I would yeah. say. Yeah, oh, like... Pro, it's better in the other games because in CSGO yeah. you don't have like two hours to think it over. Yeah, yeah. you get killed I still before. Probably use that time. If you just stand yeah. around thinking, you will die. But Hearthstone, you have that timer. Yeah. And four. Four. Oh, Ooh, weak never play lucky. by Elki. Yeah, he's gonna want to roll four on that most of the time. It was still good enough to kill it. So it's yeah, good enough. enough. And maybe it could actually be better against Brawl because you have, oh, yeah. you have yeah. higher odds too. All right, he's playing around Brawl. The choosing yeah. his RNG. That's why I chose to roll two. Okay, makes sense. Smart. So what you do? Fire X and Belcher, or uh, is this board like justifiable to maybe Brawl? Maybe you can slam to drop out the demon and then Brawl. Well, War X, drop out the demon and then Brawl. Yeah, it's yeah. also possible. So then you have War X equipped for next turn, and then you can start playing your big minions into a smaller board, so they don't just die instantly. Yeah, yeah. yeah it makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Sounds you get good. the War X to help clear, and you have Slam War X plus Maiden next turn. It's just like such a powerful turn, being able to deal five damage to one minion and develop a five five and heal yourself up. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. I guess if you War X the Void Caller and no Demon pops out before you brawl, you're still happy. Like, yeah, yeah, it's fine. But if what if another Void Caller drops out? There, you can be scared that there's also another Demon, and yeah, at some point you just gotta believe. Yeah, yeah. and that's what Rekfu is doing. Yeah, he's yeah. He's gonna believe. I like this play he by Rekfu. He's the billiard. Or maybe... Oh. Oh. oh! Interesting. Well, he's afraid that maybe the Void Caller is gonna bring out another <laughs> demon. Another demon, yeah. yeah. But now maybe the one ones trade in and the Brawl becomes less effective. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So. so what do we do here? Just top and play the small minions? I don't know, it's turn yeah. seven. I like it though. I was gonna okay. play Dr. Boom and trade yeah. somehow. Oh, Dr. Like Boom four, would have been punished the by the big game hunter, so this is a good way to... That's going to happen eventually. Right? Yeah, yeah, the sooner true. you play the Boom, the less likely they are of the big game hunter. That is true. But this is better against Brawl, so... Sure. Trading in all the little minions, get some instant value out of this Direwolf Alpha. Ooh, missed juggle. Are we doing it this way? No, yeah. you can trade yeah, the yeah, imps. You, you can trade the imps. The juggle's fine. Yeah. And uh, you probably want to keep your Voidwalker mm. healthy, huh? So that the War X can't just trade yeah, it Yeah, you can't brawl. just trade it, yeah. Because I think you have to read that your opponent has Brawl at this point. Like, their last play really signaled Yeah, yeah, it. like, and then he changed his mind because he had a white color. Yeah, yeah. So then you want to just make him keep thinking yeah. you have a demon. Yeah. Because he somehow already thinks you have a demon. Yeah. So just keep ensuring that. Okay, should be used to these kind of plays because he's a professional blocker player, so... Sure. Okay. Well, Rekful can try and pop the demon again and go for the Brawl this turn if he wants to, but it's not as good because uh, he doesn't have very much health.
support here. Probably shield maiden with it. Oh yeah. Or that. Okay. Hmm. I would just play probably BGH and shield maiden. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, this also, way he gets to squeeze in an extra hero power. Yeah. He's at 13 life, dies to 12 damage. It's pretty tough for Zoo to do. Yeah. yeah. It's not like he's losing with this line of play very often. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. It's pretty solid. So juggler implosion. So that could be, be lethal, right? right? So if he attack with bomb and hit for four for the face, he can then play the Doomguard hope, not discard oh, PO and. It's not very likely, but he can set up a lethal. Uh, well, can, well, what, if, just, what if we just PO, PO the, the boom, boom, bot. boom bot? It dies at the end of the turn, so then it can hit yeah. for four again. So he can play Knife Juggler, PO the Boom Bot, then play Doom Guard. And isn't, face isn't, isn't just best to just play Juggler, Implosion, no. deal some damage, and Because the Death Spike's there. The Death Spike's there. You it's going to clean up all the imps. I know, but uh, if you PO the Boom Bot, you're going to hit for five. Well, you he's going to be at eight. He's going to hit with imps from implosion, and then you have still doom guard in hand. So it's a lot of damage, you know. But warrior like can just start gaining life. Look at the warrior's hand. Like, yeah, he's got kind of so much life hand, gain. But. Yeah, I think the play here is juggler, PO the boom bot, and doom guard face. Yeah, you, know, you hit him for ten. Hope your boom bot hits him in the face for three yeah. or two if you win the fifty-fifty oh. juggle. He's going yeah. with the juggler line, so he doesn't assume that okay, Rathal has too much life gain off. in hand. Yeah, yeah. No, I would just PO here. And hope. Yeah, get it out he of He doesn't way. have like enough five gain. But. Okay. Well, the PO's kind of good with the egg in hand if he's planning to stick around yeah, for a while. But I don't think he can win it's if the game goes longer. Yeah, so. yeah. It's going to be a lot harder for him to get his PO out of his hand now that he hasn't yeah, used yeah. it here. So is the this board's a cleared. double hero power turn? Or maybe Armor Smith with one hero power is better? I, I kind of like the double hero power, but I no, understand I, getting I like the Armor Smith like, Because you set up bigger board, you'll gain more life. Sure. It's definitely. And it's just about damage. surviving like next two turns. So you're not gonna lose the longer game. Sure. So the tank up's not really worth it since the game's only going two more turns. There's a lot of ways to play these games when you're like winning so often. Yeah. yeah. Spots. <laughs> <laughs> the egg comes out. And you bane of doom it. That is one way to win the game. I mean, sometimes yeah. you get like <laughs> doom guard, Melganis, well, those sort of things. It's probably the best you could do here, right? Yeah, you don't develop the board at all. Yeah, floating this much win. mana does not feel good. Yeah. yeah. Now the warrior has like. So we now just double the Justicar. Car, or slam, slam bash. bash. Slam bash. Sure. I mean, this wins too. Yeah. Well, you everything wins now. Yeah. <laughs> probably. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. This feels a little awkward though. Yeah, he doesn't yeah. develop anything, but I mean, his opponent yeah. has nothing still, so I think that's fine. Yeah, this is gonna be good enough. Yeah. Yeah. I would probably just develop Justicar Car and use yep. the hero yeah, board yep, twice. Yep. So are there outs here for Zoo? What if he just slams you, Sarah? <laughs> As a Zoo player? <laughs> yeah, it would be I mean, great. You got to go deep at this yeah, point, you gotta right? You got to go really deep, yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's Sneeds that's really deep. into KT. Sneeds yeah. into KT as Zoo. Yeah. That would win the game. I mean, you got to figure something out. So there's the Doomguard. Yeah. The YOLO Doomguard. Uh, Pitches the other Doomguard. That did not go well. That yeah. was... Those uh, are the cards you probably wanted to keep. Yeah, not as intended. Oh, God. But he is able okay, to protect you with that void wall. Face. Yeah. Oh, well, he tried. Good. I mean, he's got two shield slams, two executes left, so it's not unlikely that he has one yeah. of these removal spells by now. And yeah, but now he clears at boom. And yeah. And then it's completely over. Yeah. Yeah, Run but it was a very close game. Yeah, very close. There was definitely that window of opportunity there. Elki had a chance that he could have went for lethal too. Yeah, juggler, yeah. power overwhelming, doom yeah. guard. Yeah. He had to hit uh, three to the face between the 50-50 yeah. juggle and the. Yeah. Uh, Boom bot, right? Yeah, it yeah. wasn't like the it best wasn't RNG, likely, but uh, yeah. it was the best it's option. Probably like 30 ish percent. Yeah. yeah. So you got to evaluate at those points like, is the risk worth it or can I take the safe line? Yeah. And he thought the safe line. I mean, in Elki's defense, Reckful had like all of the armor game. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He didn't have that kind of hand. Game. Yeah, yeah. So Reckful just had the hand that beats the safe line. Yeah. So. Well, Nine plus 14, seven. 16. He's one off. If any boomba. Like yeah, he, he's one but, off, but a boomba. But boomba can hit. Yeah. yeah like, do you really like, want to believe? Why would you risk this? Would you risk it? Like, yeah. You can just rather get. Maybe you do. <laughs> the balls. <laughs> yeah. The balls. Are, we do know Reckful's a very ballsy guy yeah, in general. That's what so. he wants. Like it depends yeah. how he feels, you know. So yeah. If he feels he's gonna hit. This is a 50-50. Yeah. I definitely think it's much safer to armor up, but knowing <laughs> Rexful, he's probably going to do oh, it. Yeah. He's going to oh, do yeah. it. He's a boss. Get yeah. him. Yeah. Rexful's a well, boss. God wow. bless Rexful. Yeah. He always <laughs> takes it when he has the chance. This man knows what's up. 
Uh oh, never Uh-oh. lucky. Can he die back? Or, or both I mean, we saw both two guards and one PO. Yeah. Maybe uh, that's a calculated risk on Reckful's part, right? Like, yeah. I can't lose if it goes wrong, and it's sweet if it works. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> it was probably his mental process. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He's like, this would look really cool if it works, and I can't die. Awesome. Yeah. Okay, so he won the first one, and so as Elki here, you got to think, how am I beating this control warrior? Yeah, probably with droid, like probably. He has the mid range druid, right? Yeah, he has yeah. mid range druid. So. It's not that simple as it used to be because the Dionysus isn't that great. Yeah, you would much bash. rather have like more fat minions, like yep. uh, yep. scenarios or these kind of stuff you used to have before. But mm -hmm. it's still like favorable matchup. I would say like 64 day or something like this. So also the, the inclusion of slam and bash on the control warriors part, uh, they can combine those with their weapons effectively to deal yeah, with the bigger druid minions. Yeah, they can control their life total very properly. So it's somehow difficult to take them with combo, but. You still drew it, and you still drew it. Yeah, when Druid's able to stick a minion, so strong. Uh, would you keep that Emperor? No. 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 It's not You're wild growth. You're looking for, <laughs> for wild growth and and Shredder are also very strong, like Shredder and Shens and wild growth. Yeah. You would keep an ancient uh, like ancient if lore. If you have wild growth, then yeah. yeah. All right. Interesting. Is there uh, Azure Drakes in his deck list? Because those are also a really important yeah. card. Like all the card advantages are yeah, important. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Anything that cycles to just uh, grind out your opponent yeah. that way. Alkizent is very bad, so. Yeah, this is a beautiful start for Wreckful. Wow. Oh. I wouldn't do it. Like, yeah, I would... you play the Armor Smith there normally, right? Or Armor Up. Like, most like Armor well, Smith. This but... way he's oh, really? going to be able to uh, contest it or Nass his Aspirant and then play the Accolade of Pain afterwards. So, I don't mind it. Why do you like Armor Up over Armor Smith? I, for me, I just, I just want to get out on board against Druid. I like why, why is it that useful? Like you're gonna play it and you're gonna lose it uh, to a shredder eventually, or something like this. Yeah. Or like it's gonna this. contest the shredder baby. You have a fiery war axe. This is what I would have done. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think it's fine to play the. This war worked axe out there. great. Yeah. Well, <laughs> like, don't you want to wait with Ecolite like later? Like, nah. nah, nah. So I just like getting it out as soon as possible. We see MC Tech from Elki, which we have not seen a lot of lately. Yeah. It's good against Paladin, and it's good when people aren't expecting it. So. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't see it earlier on in the tournament, did we? No, I haven't seen it, so he can yeah. hear a surprise. Yeah, Rekful has no Rekful. idea that there's an MC Tech laying in wait against him. So do we silence the draw here? Yep. Yeah. But I mean, like, even like though that the draw gets silenced, like having your act like it silenced isn't the worst case since you have like things in Control Warrior like Sylvanas and other like higher priority target yeah. silence yeah. things. And the Druid is kind of surrendering early game tempo because like Keeper of the Grove is not nearly as strong as like Piloted Shredder, for yep. example. If you were to have it, but I guess he doesn't. <laughs> Thanks, Purple. Yeah, I'm very missing you, Purple. Uh, I just so, want to cuddle. Okay, good. <laughs> I would say the Druid's not so much surrendering temper as, as uh, Wreckful is forcefully taking tempo. Yeah, yeah. And yeah the Fiery War Axe. But the uh, Mind Control Tech couldn't turn it over. If a boom oh, gets played or something, I we guess. Believe. Like, he can I mean, play Belcher into Maiden and he can have four minions after, after it, so. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. yeah what if the Druid just never alive? does anything? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's only a problem, you know. Oh, wow. He's going to hold that back on the, the Keeper of the Grove, it looks like. So he can have that answer to Sylvanas or something later. Oh, that's the boom. That's a really defensive line of play, thinking about like long term instead of trying to rush him down early, which yeah. makes a lot of sense with Elki's hand not having very much mid range pressure. Yeah. Yes, all the answers. So. Yeah. Does he have all the answers, though? Because as soon as something like Ysera shows up... Yeah, true. It doesn't really have too many answers to that. He's got a Keeper of the Grove. He can silence oh, it. There's a shade. But it's only a 412. Just a 412. 412, <laughs> and it's very easy to handle. Yeah, that piece of cake. Deals with the next uh, three 4-4s you got. No big deal. Yeah. Oh, God. Wow. He doesn't play Just Car because he's playing Boom next turn. He doesn't have time to armor up anything yeah. soon. So yep. just get the bigger body. Yeah, the bigger body is better here. Mm -hmm. I like big butts. Cannot lie. So... There's the Enchant. We're going to draw two? Yeah. Of course. And maybe yeah. Rakefell going to go face, and then I'm going to be still. Dude, we're setting, up the, we're setting up that MC tech. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's going to happen. I can't believe it. Oh, it's going to happen. Yeah. Oh, my God. I'm, be actually, I'm becoming an Elki fan right now. It could happen this turn. Like, even if he trades, like, he's still going to have, like, five yeah. minutes. Yeah. You think it'll take so. the boom? 
I don't know, because he has big game hunters, so he might not want to steal the boom. Maybe he wants to steal the he belcher. He wants to steal, you know, the belcher. Yeah, and then big game the and boom. And BJ the boom. Oh, yeah. it would be so sweet. Yeah, I want to see it dirty. so badly. Please. Come on, come on, one time. Esports. So, like, 40% of the outcomes are really good, and the other 60% are... Like, even the armor is decent. Like, everything is good. Like, yeah. yeah. You want the two big ones, though. Well, obviously. You're not just like, yeah, I'm going for the boom bot. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's never the mindset. Wow. Oh, 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 my it's, God. It's best, the best case. Time. Okay. Holy <laughs> smokes. Oh. So I would feel really miserable if I'm right full now. Because yeah, that I, was upsetting. He, he was think, so confident. Oh, I'm winning so badly. And yeah, he's like, this game suddenly, is over. Like, There's no way. Like, and the 7-7 seven, seven disappeared, the Belcher. And now these boom bots are going to face. Or, yeah. Because, like, savage. <laughs> oh, my God. You called it. I've played Hearthstone before. Yeah. I know how this goes. Well, this is going the shade, though. When, when you're feeling it. confident, those boom bots are just they're going face. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, wow. one. All right, Not cleared the slime. Were, Good old boom bot. Those were bad boom bots. Yeah. Malfunctioned. Yeah. Send if it back to Blizzard. If it weren't for the mind control tech, the boom bots kill the big game hunter every time. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. Because they take revenge. Yeah. But the mind upset. control truck confused him. <laughs> 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 Shouldn't just uh, play the up. Oh, no, no. What was that? I didn't know. No, really I was wondering that. whether I should not fire play Warx. the Fireworks and okay. kill the. But you want deck. the big board so Sylvanas doesn't die to being traded into one? Yeah. Board. Okay. But there's a silence, so. Yeah, you held on to the keeper for Saved it on turn four. Mm -hmm. This game's awesome. Yeah. yeah. He's, he had this plan going in there to try and make this go long game, and it looks like it might be working out for him. Yeah. yeah. He's like, listen, I got the MC tech. I'm going to turn yeah, it around. So I'm yeah. not going to take care about the minions he's going to plant and. I'm gonna steal them for him. Yeah, yep. it's great. So what you're gonna do? Swipe the armor smith and trade the BGH. Oh, swiping an armor smith never feels good, but yeah. it looks like one of the best ways. You to can do it. you can wrath and hero power, but the swipe is clean. not that great in this yeah. match. Wrath so. is definitely much better because it can cycle. Yeah. And then the shades sit around. <laughs> this is very good trade and yeah. like on board the shades. Oh, oh wow. Aggressive. Oh, face. Turning the gas on. I, I guess he figures whatever value trade the Sylvanas makes, he can clean up with like a Wrath or a Swipe or something, so he just sure. doesn't actually yeah. care. Yeah, and just keep as many minions on the board, I guess, to try and get yeah, that to uh, end combo. Up the game with combo, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's like excellent game sense. You're at 21, he's at like 30 something. Yeah, but. And you're like, yeah, I'm not trading. But you can get Brawl or, or whatever, so it's not that simple. You can get yeah. punished. The Brawl, you can definitely get punished. It's a risk. For but sure. just to even consider it is yeah, like, like impressive. Yeah, like, I would trade it automatically here, to be honest. Yeah. So. Yeah, I guess. But uh, Reckful does not have the brawl to really punish the, the little bit of greed there. So the risk is going to pay off for him. Yeah, everything's going Elkis way yeah. in this game. <laughs> yeah, it's been working out quite well. But uh, it, it's not over yet, because like, if we look back at uh, yeah, Elkis' hand... It's not over at all. Like. Yeah, he doesn't have too much gas. Gonna shield slam. Yeah, he has to. Okay. All right. Okay. I like this. So what do we have damage range from Elki? He's got 14 with the combo, plus another eight from the shade, being 22 on this it's turn. Not nearly enough. Yeah. Well enough. <laughs> and then he can have some amount of damage okay. to follow Ooh. that up. Okay. There's Drake a big swipe. Two. Drake swipe. Dram. Yeah, the big swipe. And like Rekfo is somehow out of cards. So yeah. Yeah. We could uh, the silence best. the one three and wrath for two on the Sylvanas. No, I would just vibe here. Ooh. Well, what's the silence for? Like denying a card draw is pretty relevant when the warrior is down to three cards, kind of yeah. grinding them out. Yeah, I agree with that. Definitely. Just and we already dealt with Sylvanas. Yeah, like you already strangling him out. Just keep limiting his card draw. I like it. And you know he doesn't have brawl, so like leaving the minion up is not that big of a deal against brawl. Yep. He's going to hold on to the Innervate. Maybe yeah, saving it for a super combo. Yeah, he wants to play like double combo or super combo with sure. Sun. Yeah, yeah. If he does hit Emperor, then that's Force of Nature's 5, the other Force of Nature's 5, and the Savage is 2, and he's got yeah. the Innervate. That is a lot of potential damage. Yeah. You can actually make a super combo yeah, if you have yeah. double Innervate and like, everything is discounted. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the, the Force, Force, Roar, Roar. <laughs> yeah, it's 40. Like, I actually... Yeah. Sarah's pretty exciting plans. here. It's like the board presence warriors looking forward to kind yeah. of try and make something happen. Yeah. The yeah. druid has to decide, all right. Oh, I, that's huge. 
Now you can execute and play Ysera and feel kind of safe. Well, if you, want. you can keep, yeah. keep the execute. Uh, like if, then now you feel kind of like less safe. Though. Yeah, like you less safe. Yeah. So, so it's a decision time for the Druid. Are you going to let the Ysera continue to get value while you hit him in the face and try and kill him? Do you move all in, or well, you can do you clear there. it? Okay. He, and keep yeah. a shade. We did save that. We did save the keeper for this yeah. sort of situation. Yeah. yeah. Works out for him. Or you can even just start throwing damage at his face too, because you have like combo, and then you have, com or then you have uh, force swipe, which is another ten on top of that. So you can hit him for fourteen plus nine this turn, so uh, twenty-three, and then hit him for ten after that. What if we boom innervate keeper silence? Yeah, I would boom innervate keeper of silence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And probably attack for seven because I would sure. be scared of Brawl or Isra's yeah. Awakenings or something. Well, like we know he already doesn't have Brawl because he hasn't played any of the three cards on the left still, and we knew those weren't Brawl earlier. Yeah, yeah, it's not so like a dope. Yeah, it's very yeah, unlikely he has Brawl, so it makes a lot of sense to develop the board. So leaving the Shade Stealth doesn't really play around BGH because we already have a boom out there for it. Yeah, I would probably attack here, but... Yeah. Plays around BGH, Youthful Brewmaster BGH. Okay. <laughs> so now he plays under Despite. You, you would play that. Cute, yeah. yeah. Okay. It's little. It's that little, right? Lethal, yeah. Okay, well played. That well, was an awesome yeah. game. It's very awesome game. Spectacular. <laughs> <laughs> I was serious, dude. Like, yeah, oh. like... <laughs> The MC Tech, man. The MC yeah, Tech is pretty was, sweet. Obviously, sweet, stealing man. the Belcher, the Boom Bug's yeah. face. Like, There's a lot of things. It was a turnover, yeah. A yeah. lot of relevant decisions were made this game. Saving keepers. Yeah, there was a lot of keeper saves that were awesome, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One one. War is out, and... Druid going to be staying up. So, Wreckful then has... Mage or they both have Druid. Tempo Mage and both have Druid, right? So yeah, so it's like a straight up mirror match now. It's like my heart Rayful goes out. has counter spells, so yeah, in yeah, a, in a mage. So yeah, counter spell is not really the best thing to go up against Druid with, but still, you don't want a Druid mirror. So he's gonna play Tempo Mage. Yeah, you're gonna play Tempo Mage. Yeah, and then he plays Tempo Mage into the Druid, and well, then like, if he wins, he's got like a Tempo it depends, Mage. Mirror. Like yeah, it's uh, a. <laughs> Usually, Temple Mage can get the early game board control and kind of snowball the game. But yeah. But sometimes, like if you don't have Entity, it's not that easy. Like it's mm -hmm. the yeah. most annoying card. Like your Entity is like a big part of why you yeah. want to be that kind of Mage deck against Druid. You okay. put pressure on them. They can't and do Entity. Oh, he, 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 he thinks Druid. Druid yeah. He's like, just not confident with those uh, counter spells, I guess. Yeah. Likes his chances with Wild Growth and Innervate. And is, is he keeping Boom? <laughs> <laughs> He just grab out another inner weight play turn two and sure. GG. Yeah, oh, wow. 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 We're wow. Going for the turn four boom. It, his opponent anything. is big game hunter though. Wow. That and he is picked up scary. double swipe to go with but it. But there could be like turn three tempo BGH and then the boom uh, yeah. back. Maybe. Maybe. Well, the double swipe off the mulligan. Double swipe force yeah, is this never good. It's so awkward. greedy to keep the boom. Like. Yeah, yeah. Very greedy. But if you hit the wild growth or something, maybe you get him. Okay. Uh, you you got to switch hold on plans. To no, you can't <laughs> switch. You're in too deep. <laughs> it's so gotta be. It what feels bad because the boom's coming down on turn four, and so is the shredder. Like, what yeah. are we doing? Well, you could coin out the shredder and then play so, another shredder, then interrape them. Oh yeah, just draw the other shredder. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Fix the okay. curve. Yeah. What you do now? You no, but you're right. You coin shredder oh, and the, swipe. Oh, you do Yeah, yeah. Just right. And it wasn't that difficult. Oh. And there, there's the shade. That's and then plan. Boom comes out next turn, so he's really hoping his opponent just tempo BGH is here instead of Azur Drake. By the way, or <laughs> this empty deck. Uh, I would play four six down here. Yeah, yeah, definitely bear to, force one him to protect. Bear force uh, one. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Okay, and there's the Dude, boom. Dude, this MC tech. Wow. The MC tech is gonna get value. Well, yeah, it's gonna be another it, MC tech the in the BGH. He steals the shade, right? He steals the shade. He steals the shade. BGH yeah. is the boom, obviously. Wow. Okay, okay. Just like last time. It's like a yeah. dream for Alkin. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Like he put these cards in here, and he was like, "This is what like, I want him to do." Like maybe Alkin should doing. be like more careful about playing boom against Alkin. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you can't expect you this see, guys, every that's, time. That's how you counter Doctor Boom, like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Are you kidding? Esports. <laughs> That, Every time. That is got to be the What most a god. Yep. <laughs> yep. 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 That's yep. what you do. Oh, yep. my god. Uh, 
<laughs> you earned it. He got esported so hard. That, was, uh, that didn't happen once. That happened twice now. Yeah. Twice. Just twice. What Woo. the heck? Do you think it's gonna happen again against Mage? Uh. <laughs> what a series! Yeah, yeah. You that think he's gonna? Incredible. Think he's gonna keep Doctor Boom and Mage? No, he's he's mulliganing that card every time. He never <laughs> wants to see it again. Yeah, no. I guarantee you, he's canceling the challenge and disenchanting it right now. Yeah, That's what done. he's doing. Well, but it would be great if he would disenchanting the. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's just done. He doesn't want to play that card anymore. Oh my god. Okay. That's a lot of science. Science is a good thing, by the way. Yeah, it's I a love science. Card. Yeah, you definitely want to mulligan away that counter spell. Yeah. Too much science for that. Drew's got that a bit is of a slow a one. Good hand from uh, Reckful there. Yeah, one, two, three, perfect. Yeah. As long as he doesn't find Doctor Boom, I think he's favored here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Coin science is less Sci vulnerable. Yeah, science is. You scientist. can save the apprentice for when you want to play Arcane Blast yeah. that yeah. turn. I mean, yeah, you could even scientist, and then if it like sticks around, maybe just try and get the apprentice out there. And maybe protected with like getting a counter spell up, then you can flame waker arcane blast in the same turn, sort of thing. Mm -hmm. So there's MC deck. So <laughs> we're getting Boom, close. Boom's oh, coming. No. We're getting close to the combo to kill it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Do you like apprentice here? I like apprentice personally. Like he didn't wrath. Yeah, he didn't even wild growth. Good play. Yeah, if he wild growth, you're afraid of keeper. But he didn't wild growth, so now keeper's not yeah. a possibility. So it's like really yeah. strong. Cool. Yeah, so Sterny innovates out something. You go flame waker arcane blast. Wow, it he keeps MC deck again. I would strongly consider it playing it as a tempo card, but he just saves it. No, no, he knows or, how good it is. Yeah, yeah, he's seen it. He's seen it do work. <laughs> <laughs> Elke has a plan, so yeah. 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 Uh, Don't want to dupe the scientist. Yeah. Good flame waker turn. Yeah, I like just getting the flame waker. Yeah, yeah couldn't yeah. deal with the first two minions. What's yeah. gonna do about this one? I, I could also stay, understand holding him back, though. Yeah, yeah you now. can keep it, like especially if the apprentice is gonna survive. It would be great. Yeah. So. I would actually consider playing duplicate to get double apprentice after the keeper, so... Yeah, definitely something to consider. All right, rip girl. She's dead. Yeah, she's dead. She's gone. No, well, clear the board here so with the Flame Waker. So the counter spell. Yeah, to protect the Flame Waker. Pretty solid. It doesn't protect against Druid of the Charge, which is a common turn five play. Yep. Yeah, that does but that's not protect it. But it protects it against Swipe. Let's see if he's been watching. But LK the probably games. knows, right? Yeah, yeah. It looks so like he's been watching the games because he knows yeah. that if no that's why he's about to get counter spell. Oh, there's the BGH. So <laughs> he's got the full <laughs> combo up. now. <laughs> now we just need to have Rectful draw Doctor Boom again. Yeah, yeah. He's got the Arcane Intellect. Yeah. I don't think he's going for it this turn. Yeah, it looks like probably Mana Worm, Frostbolt, or Frostbolt Duplicate. Okay. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. This is also good. Yeah, it's also good. Let's see if our board. Sure. Oh. More damage on the board, getting face. A lot of damage. Yeah. So you just play Taurus on here. Looks like the MC Tech might not do it this time. Yeah, the Dream might be dead. We might be getting mauled a little bit too quickly. Yeah, and we can't even use this swipe to try and clean up. I uh, should just play Taurus on probably. Yeah. Yeah, I mean. Set up here and freeze just turns. leave. Give him a chance to play a fourth minion for MC Tech. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just I mean, in. you're committed now, right? Yeah. 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 <laughs> Gotta make it happen. Like, unless. Rightful, get some burn like fireball. It's not it's completely over, so. Sure. But, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh okay. that is some burn. It's a lot of burn. Yeah, that is a lot of damage. With Flame Waker, Arcane Missiles just does so much work. I don't see a lot of Violet Teacher in Temple Mage. Yeah, yeah it's, it's an interesting tech card. choice. So, what you do here? Missiles, Hero Power, or Duplicate? Uh, and fires the missiles. Pushes a lot of damage when you have Flame Waker, Mana Worm. Yeah, and it, I mean, it can help. You get a ping in there, too, so you can yeah. maybe even clear the 5-4 uh, the with it. So I think I'd yeah. go for it. Yeah, I'd just go for it as well. Duplicating the scientists. Yeah, it doesn't really help you much. Okay. Wow, those are some good missiles. <laughs> they got the job done. Okay. Not I mean, if they went face, you got just to win. Yeah, face would have been yeah. better <laughs> if all of them went face, but... This is good enough as well. Yeah. yeah. So how does he come back here? Hard. So See. it's turn seven. He's got Dr. Boom in hand. What do you think of that play? <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't look good, man. Not very good? Man. No. See, this is what Rekful needs to do. He needs to kill him before he can play his own Dr. Boom. Yeah. Once he plays his Dr. Boom, the game's over. That's the real counter. So getting yeah. it done on turn six is the way to do it. Okay. Yeah, yeah this is the 
issue with empty tech. Sometimes they have two to three minions and just beat you up. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's definitely... That's how it goes most of the time. Yeah, yeah it doesn't yeah. always it doesn't play always perfect. Always yeah. Yeah. like a perfect minion. It's actually not the best card in Hearthstone. <laughs> but uh, it's definitely a tech Sometimes card. Sometimes it's good. It has, good, it has its matchups and its moments. I'm not sure. saying it's bad. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> what we just saw. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it was against Druid and against Warrior. And it's not usually good against these classes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's great against it's Paladin too and though. these kind of... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, we're going to go to Casino Mage's Mirror. Yeah, Casino Mage Mirror to decide so all the marbles. All the RNG, all the unstable portals, all the cool stuff. Yeah, and Rexful's got some tech cards in there, though. We got Violet Teacher. How do you think that yeah. plays out to affect the matchup at all? Should be good, right? It's a mid-range minion, yeah. It sticks around. And you make a lot of tokens, have a tempo swing yeah. off of it. Yeah, but... If is, El isn't it too if, slow, if, though? If Elki saves like all the spells and Flamebreaker, he can easily kill the tokens sure. back. Yeah, the tokens so are pretty... Meaningless. I think it's just still whoever gets board control on like turns two and three, like, like, like wins. Uh, like, I think uh, Rekful has kind of bad secrets. You know, the counter spell. Counter spells, yeah, sure. Could be here very easily negated by like one some one, one mana, mana spell. spell yeah. yeah, so it's not very effective. So I would think LK is small favorite, but yeah, because of the secret caps. Yeah. that makes sense. I tend to agree with you there. <coughs> I like keeping the flame waker. Yeah, I like it. And I might. Keep I like a keeping with... the portal as well. I like keeping the portal. The portal. Uh, why the portal? Just something to do on turn two. Even if you're like behind on board, you can do it and like create yeah. opportunities to catch back up later. And if okay. you're not behind on board, it's just a way to develop. And sometimes yeah. esports, I guess. Yeah, yeah sometimes you know. he doesn't get it's a great follow up to boom or whatever. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, he doesn't want boom. <laughs> <laughs> not that one. <laughs> not boom. He's just thinking, please, no boom. Well, it's a different deck, though, I guess. No. Okay. It would be funny if it still happens again, though. Okay, Elk has duplicate as well. Uh -huh. And duplicates probably not the best in this matchup. Whoa! It's, it's, this is a lot of science right now. It's like usually you die after the duplicate. You see this format scientist. Like you don't have time yeah. to really get the value. Scientists everywhere. Yeah. So you go for esport here. Hope. All right. You just try and missile down the scientist. I don't know. Probably not. Right. <laughs> Apparently so. So what's here? No one mana spell for Flame Waker. Spell Slinger is an interesting spell card Slinger. to play in the Temple oh, Mage Mirror. Oh, God. Yeah. It's both Snipe. players. Snipe favor. Yeah. Snipe's got to be way better yeah, than Divine Snipe's Favor. Yeah, Snipe's better than Divine Favor. Way better. Divine Favor's going to clunk your hand, so it's... Shouldn't, it, shouldn't you trade here? Like, I'm not sure if he runs second entity, but... Why? In case he do, you avoid playing Shredder. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. would like to see the trade as well there. Yeah, but he doesn't have a secret. Yeah, oh, he doesn't so have another so secret. So it's so bad for Elko. Okay. Oh, wow. So much oh, behind. Wow. He only runs one entity, one duplicate. Yeah. And he drew the entity and both scientists. So that's uh, not and the duplicate as well. So. Yeah, yeah. That is... So it's really bad for Elko, yeah. But yeah. I want the snipe to go off. Elki is the one with the Flame Waker, though, and that's a pretty important card in this matchup. Yeah. Yep. But he's really behind on the board, so mm -hmm. he needs to set up a really strong Flame Waker turn. Yeah. So what can he do? Flame Waker... Coin. Well, there's no, the counter spell up. Turn. Yeah, he's it's still counter spell up. So, well, maybe counter spell. Probably. So, yeah. What you do here? Hmm. Like you, you play duplicate and clear the scientist. <laughs> like, well, now there's counter spell up for sure. Yeah. So you give him a scientist and hope he doesn't have more secrets. Or you can crack the secret with divine favor, counter spell. I kind of like this. Is he going to take care of the, I don't think you need to take care of the counterspell with the coin yet. You can wait and do it at another time so they can't get another Yeah, but you're out. not going to shoot the Flame Baker, right, if it's countered? Yeah, yeah, but there's no reason to use the coin to get rid of it now, so I like him holding no, it. No, I meant it. you can break it with Dive in favor. Wow, look at oh, this okay. turn. Yeah, this turn. Shredder in the middle, girls everywhere. Yeah, but... So many missiles. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but he has, like, no hand. So yeah. Yeah. But he Elk does is going to be able board. to handle this. Then that's that's then, it. Then yeah. he's gonna play off the top of the deck. So sure. So what you do here? Snipe, Start with kill everything. Blast. I mean, you still have like so much tempo. So yeah, I, yeah. I like it. I like just yeah. killing everything, being ahead on board, and yeah, I saying, like it as well. Try right? and deal with it. I got three secrets. And you I play know. around divine favor as well. So yeah. <laughs> I don't know. If I, <laughs> I don't. I don't know about the shredder trading into scientist's turn. Um, maybe we could have uh, gone face the shredder go after face? trading with. Yeah, just use the arcane missiles to clear the minions and try and go face with your okay. minions. Okay, I'll keep playing around snipe. Classic. <laughs> you can. Yeah. I wonder if he's even thinking about snipe. <laughs> Probably not. 
He's, he's got a board to deal with. Yeah, he's got to figure yeah. out this problem first before he really <laughs> even starts even thinking about the secrets. Oh, you can ping and hope for the Doomsayer. What a god. All right, snipe taken care of. Always one play down. around snipe. You have to ping the Shredder here, right? Yeah. If you ping the Shredder, what else are you doing, though? Yeah, it feels Nothing. Bad. And then if it's duplicate, then your opponent just starts throwing Shredders at you. Now they have cards. Oh, it's true. So, like... That's wor That's bad. Don't do that. Uh, yeah. But what you do here? Just play something to let it counter it. Uh oh, he's pinging the shredder. Now Rekfull's hand time. is reloaded with shredders. Oh god. Oh, it's oh, so man. good for Rekfull. Yeah, Rekfull is so far ahead now. Now he's even got like a stronger hand than Elki. Wow. And a free portal. For portal, what's it? He's Sarah. Oh, that's, pretty that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I think if, if it would be boom, he would play it or not? <laughs> no, 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 no. I, I, think he would, I think he wouldn't play it. I think that's the only way he loses, and he knows it. He's like, I just got to dodge this mind control tech BGH. Just he sees please. Elky holding these many cards. Yeah. He's like, that, he's probably got mind control tech boom in his hand. Yep. Or big game under. Yeah. Uh, so it's probably over, right? We've seen both players get rewarded this match for making unusual card choices. Uh, mm -hmm. The duplicate there, and yeah. previously the MC yeah. tech. But this game was more about that uh, Elki draw both Mad Scientist and draw both Secrets. So. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Right. Counterspell now going off, and uh, it's going to need a lot of good Flame Waker RNG. <laughs> <laughs> That's not it, yeah. Yeah, that is not the one. Is it lethal? Is it lethal? Yeah, it is lethal. Oh. That adds yep. extra damage to the frothing. Yeah. Get the maximum Very value. Very precious play. Okay. Yep. So, what a G match. G what a series. Like. That was epic. So, Elki so versus Wreckful overall, they're 1-1 one one against each other. 1-1. One 1-1, one, one yeah. One, yeah. It's a 50-50. 50-50 matchup. So <laughs> 50 -50. Next time we know it's even. <laughs> yeah, next time. So. Okay. All right. We're just waiting here on the couch to have Wreckful come over uh, for a winner's Rekful. interview. Yeah. Yeah, and we get to ask him about the game. About Dr. Boom? About the Dr. Boom, dude. We definitely need to talk to him about Dr. Boom. We got a few questions to him about the doctor. That's oh, man. for sure. Wow. All right, let's scoot down so he has room on the couch. Yes. Yeah. Oh, we're moving this way? Yeah. Okay. Because he's coming from that side. All right, all right. All right, does Rightful want to have a winner's interview? I think he might be blowing us off. No, yeah. not Rightful. Yo. Hello? Hello, hey, buddy. Hey. What's up? What's up, man? What's up? This Dude. guy hates me. Oh, man, I have to talk to him. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, now you're the hero. Okay. Uh -huh. So okay. the games are complicated enough. And what do you think? He asked you if the games are complicated enough and for you. For you, so. Oh. Just stay play. focused. Stay focused. Play no, football. I need Adderall. Okay. <laughs> I think so, I, I, I need a prescription, man. All right. I, I, did I, I messed up really bad at some point, or no? No, no. Ah, MC Tech. Great, man. No, MC Tech. Best card in our to ask you. How do you feel about playing Dr. Boom against Elki? <laughs> uh, that felt pretty nice, you know. I, I was like, okay, the earlier I played, the, you probably won't have Big Game Hunter. You know, maybe yeah. I'll yeah, yeah. curve out, okay. Drop it. I didn't think it had the Big Game Hunter, but the first thing I got my control deck, I was like, okay, maybe I have a chance still. And then you get the Big Game Hunter every time. <laughs> every time. MC Tech yeah, as well. Feels bad, man. Yeah. But um, I think the my control decks were cool. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I was winning that War Game. By so much, and then, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was you were like miles ahead, and then he plays that combo, yeah. Yeah. Six, seven. takes it away. Yeah, yeah. 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 ridiculous. Twice. Well, but like, yeah, the you didn't have it supposed in to kill BGH. Game, so. huh? The boombots are supposed to kill BGH like every time, right? Yeah, y yeah. But my boombots, uh, they went face, and then it's Belcher for one or something. Yeah, they were That's pretty sad. defective. Yeah. I don't know. You should probably contact Blizzard. I feel like about Blizzard that. is trying to nerf my account or something. Uh -huh. So I played someone else's account. Oh, did you? Yeah, That's how you win. Yeah, yeah. Okay, makes sense. So, uh, card choices. You had some interesting card choices in that Tempo Mage list. What was with the Violet Teacher, the Duplicate, and the Counter Spells? Well, um, I was thinking a lot of the decks you play against Mirinity is not actually that good except for Druid. Because okay. you play Warrior, it's not that good. Freeze Mage, it's not that good. Uh, Secret Pally, Mirinity's not really that good. Sometimes it's good, but... Yeah. Even, even if you, like... Uh, counter Spell's not really good against Secret Pally either, because... But well, it, it is against muster. Kings. It's, not against, it's good, against, good against Muster and Kings, but it's not good against Secrets. Sure. It really depends. It's... Uh, Go either way. Uh, but uh, Counterspell is pretty good against Freeze Mage. Yep. And it, it, it's pretty good against Druid, even though it, it, Mirren is better. And I, I just thought it catch people off guard. Yeah. So, so. yep. It worked out. So it worked out for you, yeah. Yeah. The duplicate at the end there on the Shredder. Duplicate? Yeah, yeah. See, I ran out of steam, and then I have duplicate. It's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's fine. Yep. Right. So you guys got any more questions for Rekful? Probably. Pretty good snipe. Pretty, pretty good, good snipe, snipe yeah. yeah. 
Nice. Snipe was cool. I thought I was going to get the Flame Waker. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah it was reminding right. me of the old Gadget Zan days where you put yeah, up Snipe. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So right. But sweet, then. That's it, right? You win, so... Awesome good, match. Right. So good luck tomorrow. Congrats, man. Okay. Poker time. Poker time. <laughs> Poker time, man. Okay. So... So Rexful is moving right, on right. to top 16, right? That yeah, was the same as Ostkaka, it was pretty. Okay, and then Elki is out now. Elki huh? is out, but he um, performed really well here, he so I expect him yeah, he performed in the well. future tournaments as well, because yeah, definitely he impressive. made a very strong performance here. So yep. yeah. And now he's on Liquid, so he's going to be representing them yeah. too. So really good to see. Yeah. So who do we have coming up next? I don't know, there's the group with Taish. The group with Taish is next? What group yeah. is that? Taish. Super GJ, GJ Froden. Oh, okay, Froden. So Tice Froden going to be playing next. Yeah. And I guess we're going to be taking a short break before we get that underway. Can't wait to see that match. You don't yeah. really get to see Froden play every day. Yeah. He's normally a caster role, but I think he's actually a strong player. I we think he's got a shot. We're going to see for sure. Yeah. I can't wait to see. Hopefully, you all stay tuned to catch Tice versus Froden. We'll be right back.